Okay guys, so I'm going to go ahead and hop right in. Hey Nikki, so I am having a situation. There is a boy that has been in my life for almost two years now, and I have been dealing with a lot of drama from my dad, only because he's not my type, lol meaning he's kinda not all there, you know? I like him a lot and he tells me that he loves me, but I can't find a way to get my dad to approve. I really do like him, but my dad would kill me if I actually took a shot at trying to be with him. What do I do? Okay, so here's the thing. Sometimes parents just have a hard time letting go of their kids. And when they want to date, they kind of freak out because they're their little girls or little boys and they just like, they see them as that and it's hard for them. But on the flip side, sometimes it is just because you're maybe younger and you have the emotion of it so you don't necessarily see the relationship as it fully is and as a parent an adult who's been through life seen things they look at it sometimes and they see like whoa this is not good for you and they just love you so much they want the best for you so what I would say is I would, and this depends on how old you are too, because I think if you are like 14, I don't really think you should be dating anyways. And I know that a lot of people get really mad at me when I say that, but I don't say that because it's like, I'm like some old fuddy-duddy. I say that because I think at like 14, you should be focusing on your schoolwork, having fun with your girlfriends or guy friends or whatever, and finding what you want to do with your life and just having fun. Like they're... The opposite sex will always be there. You know what I mean? It's like rushing it. It's kind of like I know you want to grow up. I know you want to be a grown up really bad and you like someone. But I find that dating young oftentimes because it almost always ends in heartbreak anyways can leave people really jaded and seeing the opposite sex in a negative light when really it's just like, okay, well, they were younger and immature. Like, how was it gonna end? You know what I mean? So if you're young, I would just recommend letting it go and just having fun and finding some purpose in your life with what you want to do and hanging out with friends. But if you are older, 16, 17, 18, somewhere in there, I would sit down and talk to your dad. And I would say like, you know, dad, I really like him, but I really know you care about me and have my best interest at heart. And I care about your opinion. Can you tell me the reasons that you don't want me to be with him? And not asking that in a manipulative way to try to like, oh yeah, I'm going to sound nice and get around it and then convince him to let me date him. Um, but genuinely to find out why. What is his reason? Because he may be able to bring some insight about this boy that you either didn't see at all or you were trying to go like, la 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 la. And he goes, no, this is why. And then all of a sudden you can't ignore it. You know what I mean? So, um... I think that sometimes we can like demonize our parents like no, they don't want me to be happy they're just being old they don't want me to date but your parents like love you I know there are cases where parents you know I'm not saying parents are perfect and all parents want the best for their kids that's why I'm saying you need to talk and find out if he has a legitimate reason but to make a generalization parents want the best for their kids they want their kids to be happy um, and have a good life so you need to hear them out and hear out the reasons because he might be able to open up your eyes to something you didn't see and if there isn't one if he can't really give you a reason maybe that's when you say like dad I really respect your opinion I really appreciate your opinion but I really like him and I hope you can accept the fact that I do want to start dating him that's you know at the end of the conversation if you're not seeing any reason not to and your eyes haven't really been open to anything new um that would be what i do so um i know that's a lot i just slammed in there but that's kind of my take on it um find something you love to do though that's kind of good for anyone i think any age whether you're dating not dating young old i think we all need to focus on finding stuff that makes us feel alive and makes us feel a passion and a purpose like people want a purpose People want passion, so get up, start moving to find it. So I know that's a weird way to close that, but I feel like sometimes we can tend to date and look to the opposite sex for that fulfillment and that passion, but they're not going to give it to you. So um, yeah, that is it. Uh, send your letters, or letters, messages to asknikkip at gmail.com, and I'll see you later, playa, bye. So to add in that he's smart in this stuff, like I totally believe that. I don't think that's the issue at hand. Um, I think what the issue is, honestly, is if he's sober and how long he has been sober. 